So today we're gonna to be talking about giving feedback, receiving feedback. This actually could be the difference between getting that job or not getting it. Okay, so let's talk about giving feedback first. Get all the info. If you're the person giving the feedback, it's important that you get all the info. Like, what are their goals? What are they trying to achieve here? As well as their background. Then I really encourage people to do what I call a compliment sandwich. The whole entire idea is that you don't want to just look for holes. You don't want to just look for the bad stuff. You want to also look for the good stuff and encourage that. Because if you're only talking about the bad stuff, then they might have a misconception of actually how well they're doing. And even though that they have a nice portfolio with some things that they can improve, they might actually think that it's a horrible portfolio and what's the point? And if you can, if you know the person, you know, you don't want to give the same approach to everybody. You know, some people, they fall over when you push them. Some people need that push so that they could push back and really excel. Also, at the very end, ask if anything is missed. Is this everything? Is there anything I might have missed? Anything that you want to mention? Like that kind of a thing. Generally, that is a really nice way to give feedback constructively, but also encouraging. And then lastly, we wanna talk about getting feedback. Number one thing is try not to give any excuses, right? Isn't this like one of your pet peeves when you're talking to somebody, you're giving them feedback and they just keep coming back with, well, actually, you know, because of this and this, yeah, well, actually this isn't my best portfolio. This isn't my best work or any other excuses. The other thing is pay attention, especially if you're at an event, things like that, or if you're on a Zoom call with the person giving feedback, pay attention because nothing's worse than wandering eyes when you're giving somebody feedback, right? They're giving you feedback and you're like, uh-huh, 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 yeah, 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 uh -huh. It kind of makes the person giving the feedback going, why did you ask me for feedback in the first place? It doesn't look like you're very interested at all. A bonus is if you write down notes. That is really, really nice because it really shows that you're paying attention, you're valuing the feedback, and therefore when you ask for feedback again in the future, that person will be so much more receptive to that. Did I miss anything? Let me know. Otherwise, there you go my little video about how to give and how to receive feedback.